फ्रेंड्स 113 डेज ऑफ वॉर एन इटालियन न्यूज चैनल स्काई हैज एडमिटेड दैट इट्स वेरी लाइकली दैट बुचा सिविलियंस वेर एग्जीक्यूटेड बाय आर्म फोर्सेस ऑफ यूक्रेन बिकॉज दे कोलैबोरेटेड विद द रशियंस एंड लेटर एंड ऑफ कोर्स द ग्रेट माइंड ऑफ यूके इंटेलिजेंस said that it is russian army while withdrawing they murdered them and of course so called they committed war crimes in the meantime deep interdiction sorties that is bombing and shelling continues by the russian military in lviv nikolaev pokrovsk railway station the nepro petrovsk lishichansk and kharkov of course the targets are mainly the western and nato supplied weapons rt mlrs fuel stores tanks etc russian army is gaining in donbas where it is said to be failed in kiev or even in kharkiv temporarily basically because the logistic supply through railway which is quite dense in donbas industrial zone and a great help to the russian military from in severodonetsk the fight for azot continues while the fight is moving towards slavyansk krematorsk and even lishichansk and in north for kharkov in northern part and northeast part the heavy fight between the two army continues moving forward and backward But kiev seems to have become makka madina Albanian Montenegro and North Macedonia's heads had visited and now today we have Italian PM French president and <clears throat> German chancellor all are there in so called solidarity the other news is that in NATO meeting first time Japan will be joining them of course as a guest and us is said to be giving another 1 billion worth weapons to ukrainian while china has reaffirmed its support to russia in whichever way that has to be seen and uno has said that food crisis is looming while we know that energy crisis is already there in entire europe and even in usa For your information, UNESCO has said that 770 million people are illiterate worldwide. Out of that, two third are women. We also know more than 50 to 60 percent humanity is either hungry or starving or lack sufficient nutrient food. This is the condition of 21st century humanity, where in more than five to 600 US dollar trillion wealth exist on the earth but in hands of very few maybe few hundred only well friends the two extreme continues the militarization of the globe wherein the working class is being reduced to not even worth robot or animal those who are not looked after and other side our exploitation and repression keep watching friends thank you